All right, this is imminent. This is actually my favorite new map um, out of all of them. It looks crazy. It looks like it would just be horrible. Worst map ever. It's got a ring going around it. And no. Well, I mean, who knows? Everyone else may hate it in the world, but my land group likes it pretty good. And yeah, it's my favorite one. All right, started out. They spawned five, it looked like. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, this is how we call out the levels. I mean, they're, they're how they go in height. And the numbers are on the... Um, on each level. So right now I'm on four. My teammate was on one. Four is really important, by the way, but I'll talk about that later. Um, this doorway to my left, if you just saw it, you can walk down to two from there. Um, from two, you can port to three. I mean, yeah, it's it's just gonna sound crazy, me explaining it. So we'll just watch the gameplay, and I'll I'll try to just talk about what's happening. So I'm on 4 OS. Here's why 4 is so important. From 4, you can see rockets. I can look down here and see Cloak. It'll be right below me. They haven't been in any position to come and get it. Interesting play on their part. Let's frame with the assault rifle there. I guess just trying anything. Looks like they spawned 3. I'm on 3 right now. They did spawn 3. I'm going to jump back. Um, from Cloak, you can jump to 1 or jump to 3. That's another thing about this map. You can move just about however you want to move on this map see now i'm already on five i was on cloak two seconds ago you know um five is a good an okay area um you can see cloak you cannot see over shield from five unless you get in weird spots uh you can you can see the walk up to it. i just naded my teammate on his spawn almost um but yeah you want to control four if you treat four kind of like os and prisoner or green and damnation um you know, it's a good control point. Uh, that's really all I can say about that. I wouldn't say it's good to camp it. People camp it, and that's when they, they'll lose it. Because if they just sit right here, they're going to lose cloak. And if someone has cloak, they're going to take back four pretty easily. You can shoot from so many different places in this map. Quick camo is really important here. Just like hang them, well, just like, you know, any map. But you're not getting out of there without using quick camo. Um, there's a corner in this, a random in this corner. I hope, yeah, there we go. And look at that. We already have the most plat. Oh, well, now we don't. We almost had the most important platform back. I'm gonna try to kill this guy. Let's go for over shield. Rocket's pretty interesting. Um, it's not necessarily, I don't know. It's not great to have rockets on for unless you're trying to get the next OS. Uh, you want to have rockets with your cloak guy moving out and about throughout the map two is not a great place actually from two you can stand back in a corner and kill someone camping at overshield so it has a very niche importance um i have been killed that way i have killed people that way it, it, it's a nice place to be this is top snipe what my teammate just went to uh it is a random so here's what's cool about top snipe you can see a ton of things you have great lines of sight it's hard to be shot you can be naded but it's one way so, if they know you're there, you're not getting out alive, unless you have overshield. Um, and even then, you're probably not getting out alive. So, while you have all these advantages, all these great, great different angles you can shoot from, um, that's all you have. Uh, that's it. You, you will die if they know you're there, and they can get to five or three or anywhere they can nade it. I should have naded. His teammate was spawning. Oh, well, looks like it didn't matter. This is definitely my host. Um the way it looks I'll check before I post it so right now we have control of four again but as you see when I know my teammate can get over shield like I'm probably said to my teammate at some point hey you know well not right now because two people are approaching us but go for cloak again I wouldn't I wouldn't necessarily recommend rushing top snipe like I did just then unless you have an advantage it, you know something like they have no clue you're there they're distracted with your teammate at four um, or you have cloak or not cloak, but over have overshield. If you have cloak, you don't need to be in top snipe. You need to be moving around. It's very hard to pinpoint people in this map. Like I was saying earlier, you can go anywhere and everywhere uh, from just about anywhere in the map. So you see me shooting at top of long ladder there. Um, the people I, I was playing against, Tyler, loves to go long ladder to take back four. It's a it's hard to take back four, just straight up. It's, it's difficult to find against good people. Um, long ladder is one of the better places to be. You saw when I started getting shot from behind. I dropped off and immediately took my chances with four guy, which I should have killed him if I would have shot better rockets. Uh, you just got to get on their line of sight, you know. Um, 
Line of sight, so important. Positioning, so important. Ooh, there, there's a clutch spot right there. At three snipe, or low snipe, as it's referred to, because there's a sniper at that very, very top portal. And there's one low snipe there. Um, you can you can kill people go, going for overshield. One's actually not even a horrible... There's not a really, really horrible place to be in this map. Of course, you don't want to spawn at two or one when power-ups are spawning. But you don't want to spawn at red shotgun and hang them. Ever. Not just when power-ups are spawning. And you don't want to spawn in, you know, plasma rifle and damnation. So, it, it's, it's the same sort of thing. I actually think two's a little more useful than both of those spots. And both of those maps, so... Um, you use the... I've used the whole map throughout my... The mini games I played in Eminent. Um, not so well, I guess. It's good to jump up from the side going for OS, obviously. As you've seen, that's how we've done it most, if not all the times. Good shots from my teammate. Too bad he didn't finish him off. Um, see me nading here because he can jump. A horrible nade, bounced off that ledge. He can jump up from three. It looks like they spawned one. So he probably went one. Now, because I know he spawned one, you see me immediately rush long ladder. I need to get these rockets before Cloak Guy does. Doesn't matter how I do it. Um, if I would have been up on four more, I would have pushed portal and dropped. Cloak Rockets is dangerous. Cloak Sniper is dangerous in this map. If you like sniping with your uh, quick chemo weapon of choice in this map. Oh, uh, you see, I stood on the other side of that hoping if someone went five, they wouldn't see me. Tyler was thinking about it already. He's probably going to kill me. Oh. Very surprised that did not kill me. He knew we were at four. Where else would we be? Ooh, great shot by uh, KY Blues there. Not sure where he spawned. Four. His teammate will spawn over at four as well. Right there. Should have been there. Spawned in the building. Yep. Cloak. Uh, about Cloak. Only go for Cloak. Well, I'm not going to say only because I've said before, everything's situational in Halo 1. Go for Cloak if you think they're at like, well, they can kill you from two doing it. Go to Cloak when you have both of them down or you know they're at a, they're they're just going from one to five through the portal. They have no way of hitting you then. You know, make, make sure they cannot get a shot on you. They will kill you if you're getting Cloak at a bad time. There is no way around it. You can drop to, if you drop to one, they're going to kill you more often than not always go quick when you jump for that cloak try to be quick camoing every time don't jump down there with a the sniper rockets you have sniper rockets let your teammate do it give them rockets you know I, well you know do whatever you want really i mean i do it so i shouldn't say that i do stupid stuff all the time but Killing spree. we call that four building there or two building whatever you want to call it great shots from guy three you can kill people going from it. That's why you jump up the side there. You jump up the side where my teammate just did it. They cannot kill you from three unless they are sniping you. And they have to hit you at the perfect moment. Again, you saw me check for Cloak. Saw that Cloak was gone. I went four in case Cloak does kill me. Rockets are down for my teammate who has overshield. I was just trying to get Rockets out of, out of, the, uh, out of Cloak's grasp right there. I don't even really want them at four. I don't even like being at four for them. You have to control four. I, I much prefer to let my teammate control OS and four, and I like to go for uh, cloak and kind of run around, do a bunch of different things. You see me now just playing really careful. I don't know why. I'm, I think we're up by quite a bit, um, but I don't know where cloak is at, so I'm waiting. Out. He's dead now. When my teammate spawns, I'm probably going to leave. I would almost bet I'm going to leave if he doesn't. Yep, he stayed, so I'm, or he left, so I'm staying now. Don't know where his teammate is. My teammate picks him off. I'm probably going to die off this nade. It's very good. I'm going to fire up here and jump for overshield. This guy's probably going to jump for cloak. Yep. He jumped for cloak. You can get cloak. You can jump as high as you want for cloak in this map. You can jump off the top sniper if you want. Because if you hit the incline, you're not going to take any damage. You're just going to slide right down to it. Cloak is every minute, by the way. OS every minute. If you couldn't tell by now. Rocket's two minute. Standard. Standard stuff here. Real great shots by me. Probably hitting one out of about 24 just then. He's stuck in three building right now. If his teammate's dead, I just naded right there at that pistol. Their teammate, if they are in this building up this ladder, they will, their teammate will spawn there every time. So it's an easy, uh, easy spawn kill right there. They are both at five right now. I'm not going to chase them. No point. I'm going to try to get shots on them from three. Teammate's going to nade them from four. They're kind of stuck right now. I should look down at one port because they could always push back through there. From one, you can actually jump to two and port to three or go up to four. You can walk up the side. 
You might see one of us do it shortly. I don't know. I'll spawn four. Yep. Spawns are fairly predictable. The only randoms are there's one, which if it happens, I'll show it to you. Usually won't happen. We've had control of four almost the entire game. You won't see it much if you've got four control. My teammate will spawn in four building right now or outside of it. Yep. See, it's just they, they can't catch a break. Every time they might get four control, we're getting we're getting the next OS. And it's just... I don't know how close this game ends up being. I don't I don't have many imminent games on tape, so I just had to go to the one. You see me right here getting out of line of sight and chucking some nades at two guy. Just standing up here. Very hard to get a nade where you can hit where I'm standing right now. I go quick camo, do the exact same thing, because they're probably trying to nade me. Here's where you can jump to three. I don't know if we've seen it yet. The random on three is that corner to my right behind me right now. That is the three random. There's also a random on top of three building. People like to get up on top of the building to my right above that sniper and snipe from there. It is actually a great place to snipe from. It's a really good position because if your teammate's dead, you're giving them a random. It's hard to kill. Wow. My guy, if you have an anchor at four, my teammate's being an anchor right now. The other guy can pretty much do whatever he wants. See me shooting at that random cloak guy might be there since his teammate's dead, I figured. He was not. Honestly, he'd probably already been spawned by now. I hit the guy at long ladder, like I said. Too late likes to go long ladder, take back four. Not a bad idea, but when you do that, you got to have a guy go little ramp or five at the exact same time. Or you are, it's very hard to just go up there and kill people by yourself if they're they're both kind of set on keeping four. Oh, some amazing shots by me. Should just put that away. I stepped back so my teammate would spawn four and not get under under me at three at the little ramp spawn. Although he shouldn't have gotten it anyway because too late was there. Great nade by them. Uh, uh, yeah, that side's kind of dangerous to jump up on if you know they're at three. Here's where I was talking about you can see overshield. If I was to jump up on the wall right there, you could see someone running up the side to overshield. Right now, I know I can't get to cloak. If I port through, they still could jump on it and, and uh, they'd have too much time to get it from four. So I nade it off so they don't have a chance. Oh, here's here's an important aid, and I might have messed it up. I don't remember if you zoom in or not. You zoom in. Yep, I uh, made that nade up. Uh, it blows rockets right to you at five. Great nade. You see me shoot at long ladder again. Being sure. Oh, and Cloak Guy. I figure, hey, Cloak Guy's behind me. He's at least not getting rockets. So I run off the side. Get killed for it, but wow. Never mind. He, he yeah. Again, I mean, I don't know if they're just not doing a job of controlling four. I feel like we're getting fairly good spawns and we're both dead. Pretty lucky for us. You can get a lot of good snipes from where I'm at right now when people are controlling four. There are a lot of ways you can take four control back. Um, they're just not pushing at the right times and together. I mean, I'll try to find people like to stand up there when they're red team on that red light. It does work sometimes, I'll be honest. I don't see people until it's too late on occasion. Um, I'll, I'm going to try to find another imminent video maybe if this one uh, just doesn't do it for you. Because this one, not the closest game, not, not a blowout or anything either, but... I'd like to find one from someone's point of view where they're taking four back because that, that is difficult against good people. Um, but yeah, my favorite new map. Tons of fun. Lots of movement. Good stuff.